Hello coders, I'm Matt Ready here. Today we're going to be looking at a musket data pack I recently made. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Now in order to get the musket, you must first make the gun workstation. See there. To make it, it's quite simple. Two planks on the sides there, two pieces of iron, and then a piece of leather. And you get the gun workstation. Place it down, and right here you have your custom crafting gun workstation. In here, you have all the recipes for a musket. It takes no planks, a tripper hook, two iron, and a flint. It's be flipped if you want to do it. Then you have all the ammunition and the two upgrades you can craft. So let's look at the first piece of ammunition, basic musket ball. It just takes paper, gunpowder, and iron nugget. So if we grab our musket and musket balls, place this in our offhand. Right here, you can see the muskets unloaded. If I shift, it loads up. Then I can just shoot, and the ball will shoot out that way. Now, let's say you want a little bit more of a powerful musket ball. You can make a hardened one via having the normal musket ball, paper, iron, and charcoal. We grab that instead. I'm going to summon a husk, while the normal musket ball takes roughly 5 hits to kill a husk. But the hardened musket ball takes only 2. Just like that. Now the third ammunition type is the gold coated musket ball. Just use sugar, paper, and gold to make this. And this will go twice as far, so if I put this in my offhand and load it up, while normal musket ball will only go around 20 to 30 blocks, it shoots out really fast. That can be useful for long range hits. Now there are two upgrades you can add to the musket, the ramrod and the counterweight. To make these, simply open up the crafting table, and it's a little expensive. It takes grind, obsidian, diamond, and iron for the counterweight. And the ramrod takes iron, tripwire hook, and diamond. And essentially, to add them to the musket, you simply place them in your offhand and then hold the musket. Now it says its upgrade is a ramrod, which means it takes three times less to load. So if I put that in there, it only takes like three seconds. like that. Now if I had a second musket that didn't have an upgrade, I could add the counterweight to it, which while less noticeable, it does increase the accuracy of the musket by two times. So it'll fly a lot straighter. When this pack is downloaded, you'll have a zip file. If you extract it, you'll get a folder with these three items. This is your resource pack, this is your data pack, and this generated file needs to go into the world save before you run the data pack, otherwise it gets funky. That's about it for today, folks. Thank you for watching, and as always, keep coding.